solid ice around the South Pole. The icebreaker departed on her second journey to the White Continent. Amid tears, laughter and well wishes from family and friends. Aboard, scientists, researchers, a group of engineers and specialists from SANSA. Their mission? To install a new digital radar on the Antarctic research base. The radar basically is used to study the ionosphere. Uh, it's a native radar, so we can bounce the signal off the ionosphere and get the, the signal in return. And from there we can tell how is it moving, how dense is it, what's happening. Scientists will also spend the next year gathering information on the composition of the ice. This will help them get a better understanding of climate change and rising sea levels. We have public works going to prepare for refurbishment of the base and of course as usual we've got the scientists going to carry out their scientific work as well as support teams from the defense, from public works and, 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 and other supporting departments. For family members it will be a festive season without their loved ones. Excited and um, my husband's birthday is the 4th of, uh, 1st of this, uh, December and it's the fourth time he goes to uh, Antarctica and I, he must look after himself. The takeover team is due to arrive back on home soil in February 2015. Nomao Tusolwandle, SABC News, Cape Town.